I literally just filmed a mystery unbagging video. If you've not seen that, go ahead and check that out. Today we are going to try on the pile of clothes that I had set aside to potentially keep. And I'm going to show you what this pile looks like and then we will see what I actually end up keeping. And I'm going to attempt to try some things on and share them with you. We will see how this goes. Here's my pile of clothes that I am going to try on and see if they will be incorporated into my closet or not. We're going to start with tops because that's, I feel like, the easiest thing. First item is this sweater. So not the right season. But that's okay. When you thrift, you don't have to thrift within the same season. Okay, this has got a very large, like, turtleneck thing going on. And I can already tell this is just a tad bit itchy. And I'm not about that. So, let me try and back up as much as I can and show it to you. We have a Vineyard Vines quarter zip. Let me look. Okay, so this is cute. Again, like, I don't know, like, I guess I would keep this if, like, I couldn't resell it or if a buy sell trade won't take it. But I think I'm actually going to try those things first. And then, like I said, worst case scenario, then I will keep this one. It is very comfortable. I just don't know if it's 100% my style. Like, I kind of like it without, like, with my hair <laughs> in front of the plaid. I'm not sure I love the plaid, so. We have a Duluth red and black plaid, but I'm not sure if this is men's or women's. Actually, let's see. I think there is a way to tell. So this is on the left. So this is women's. I have heard that if the buttons on a button up top are on the left, then they, it's women's. If they are on the right, then it is men's. So I'm not going to go ahead and button this all the way, but it's definitely too big. <laughs> Darn it! Oh, I really like Duluth items. So here we can kind of see the color and print and pattern. I think what I'm going to do with this one is I'm going to look it up to see if it's something that I can list. If it is not, then I will keep this for next season. This is from Calvin Klein. This is like a little bolero thing that you would wear over top of a dress. This is kind of what, what that looks like. And I don't wear a lot of dresses. Um, but this is very nice and simple to wear over a dress. I would not wear it, obviously, with what I'm wearing right now. So far, I'm actually not keeping anything that I have tried on. Like, not like, oh, I love this, I'm keeping it, I'm not doing anything else with it. This is just uh, a very basic v-neck, and I'm gonna try it on. I don't think I would actually wear this because I don't know if it's just too basic or, or what. Uh, or maybe it's just like the perfect length and I'm just somebody who really likes things a little bit longer. Um, the sleeves are the perfect length and again, I usually like my sleeves a little bit longer. It technically fits great. I just don't think I'm going to keep it. Those are all the tops and I'm not keeping a single one. Okay, now let's try on bottoms. Again, the angle's probably not the best, but it was the best way that I could show you these. Actually, I may try one other alternative because this angle is so not flattering <laughs> but these are the cabby like stretchy joggers and all well, these pockets are nice I don't know I don't know I don't know guys like I kind of feel like I would keep these they're a little bit big here like in this area <laughs> um so I think I'm actually going to see if I can list these. Okay, I'm gonna switch angles because I don't like this angle. These are actually the No Name brand pair of shorts. Guys, I'm very self-conscious about my legs and stuff, so just don't say anything. <laughs> um, but here's what they look like. You guys are seeing first because the mirror is behind me, so I'm gonna look in the mirror now. <laughs> see what I think. Oh, oh, okay, so. I don't think that this paper bag kind of style is really in, but I like these. Again, no body shaming here, okay? <laughs> I'm not feeling 100% comfortable showing you this try-on, but I'm going to do it. So 
I actually really like these. I'm keeping something. Can you believe it? <laughs> Definitely keep. These are the time and true pants, the ones that are new tags. They didn't think I was going to like. These are so comfy, guys. Like, they are definitely big. <laughs> really, really big. I mean, like, very big. But, and they definitely have a wider thing. These might, maybe they're supposed to be cropped. Yeah, these are definitely supposed to be cropped, but I am so short that they actually hit me perfectly. <laughs> that always happens. That always happens to me with pants. Crops end up fitting me great. So, I may have to keep these. Oh man, I may have to keep these guys. I know it's hard to show you everything, but like, I think these are my second keep. Yep, keeping these. Plus, these only retailed for 12 bucks, so it really wouldn't make sense to resell them. Next up, the North Face shorts. And I know it doesn't help because I am wearing a black uh, top underneath, but you know, this is where they end. <laughs> um yeah these will be great for kayaking like i am i'm liking i'm liking these a lot all right i do want to point out that my bottom half is my problem area of my body and i'm just so shocked that these bottoms are working i have the hardest time finding bottoms that actually fit me the hardest time so this is like i, I mean i'm just have no words okay so these are from Maurice's and these are the ones that have the little um what is this rope drawstring <laughs> and I don't know I think I'm gonna have to keep these too again these may not be in style anymore but I have such a hard time finding things that fit I have zero shorts guys zero shorts that fit me so I'm keeping these. I finally will have something to wear <laughs> for summer. I'm so happy. You guys have no idea. Okay, another keep. So far I'm keeping, I think, every pair of bottoms except for these cabbie ones so far. I have one more item to try on. No way, guys. No freaking way. I did not think that these Chico pants were going to fit me. I thought they'd be way too small. And they are a little snug. I will be honest, they are a tad snug. You're not going to be able to tell because they're black, but... They are a tad bit snug, um, but they stretch and they're so comfy. Like th this is the So Slimming from Chico's line and I love that line. Now I've only ever thrifted from that line. Uh, let me put that out there. I've never paid full price, but every time I find a Chico So Slimming, they actually work out. And these are more of like a skinny or like a tapered whatever uh so that's fine with me because yes guys I am so thrilled you have no 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 idea how happy I am that almost every single bottom fit me I now will have bottoms to wear especially the shorts for summer I am so excited <laughs> this mystery bag was awesome like I would have never thought that like the bottoms from this mystery bag would be just perfect for me. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. I hope that it was fun for you. This was a little nerve wracking for me, but it was also kind of fun to find some new things to add to my wardrobe. I needed shorts. I had no shorts that fit me and I now have shorts to wear. It may not be on trend. I have shorts to wear. So if you enjoyed this, leave a comment down below. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe for more, I really appreciate it, and I will see you all next time. Have a wonderful and beautiful rest of your day, guys. Take care. Bye.